Hey everyone, this is Ariel Royalty and we are back for Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep episode 10. Last time we tried to be Captain Dark at Rumble Racing and failed big time. Now we're going to try again. And I want to tell you something quickly. What is that over there? I cannot read it, it's too far away. Yeah. But um, I'm going to be making a change to my recording, well my releasing schedule. Pretty much now, from this episode onwards, my videos will only release on Mondays to Friday. So every weekday at 6pm UK time. So you should be able to figure out what 6pm UK time is for you and just keep an eye out so yeah just Monday to Friday now weekends are pretty much my time off so on to the racing let's try again take two take two at this course at least let's see if I can actually beat him now that I'm getting used to the controls again Some of you jump with that. <laughs> Phew. The second day I thought I was gonna lose again. Okay. Captain Dark came last. Lol. In the Mirage Arena, high potion. Oh, my coat must have sprung a spring. Yahoo's just wait. Next time I'll clobber all of you. Yippee! I hope he's gone for good. Nobody's gonna vote for a weasel like you, Pete. Pete? Vote? 
What are you talking about? Chip means the Million Dreams Award. It's a very popular part of our dream festival. Everyone in town votes for who we think is the most exemplary citizen. And since everybody knows how much of a troublemaker Pete is, he probably figured wearing a disguise was the only way he'd get any votes. No votes, no prize. Yeah, the prize is all he really wants anyway. He doesn't care about being a good citizen. Oh, I think that's very sad. The award is supposed to help us appreciate how much we all look out for each other every day. Well, one thing I know for sure, I'm voting for Tara. Your racing really saved the day against those monster carts. Hip, hip, hooray for Tara! <laughs> well, I got something out of it, too. I learned that you don't always have to bend the rules to reach your goals. All this time, I've been staring into the darkness. But that doesn't mean I have to jump in. Okay, I got a trophy. Ugh, come on, Lord. Okay, I've got all the treasures. What world is that? Uh, I have a hunch. Okay, next on my guide it says Olympus Coliseum. Hmm, I could do that in the next episode, but that would make this one super, super, super short. So I think I'll start it. the main series, so poor Sir Cleef is going to be a bit younger. Wait! You! You're done. Dark Molly! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go! That worked. Note to self, put on a cure. Oh, thanks, they kicked me out of the world in the process. That was pathetic. Skip. <laughs> I know what to do, it was just doing it that was the problem. Okay, these are the bugs that kill me. Take that. So let's get rid of them. So long. You're done. Let's go. Oh god. You're done. Here. Here. Okay, this time 
time it was a bit better. <clears throat> you okay? Huh? Yeah, thanks. <sighs> Guess they were too much for me. I'm just gonna have to train harder. You're pretty tough. It really handled those things. Are you here to enter the games? What games? The games games. To see who's strongest. One day, I'm gonna win them all and become a true hero. Hey! Where are you? Front and center right now! Or I'm tacking on another thousand laps! Uh-oh. Gotta go. The Coliseum's just up ahead. I, I hope I get to see you fight there sometime! A competition. Hmm. I should find out how strong I really am. Jeez Louise, one chump after another. It's like a who's who of Decapolon disasters around here. All I need is one measly warrior tough enough to give Zeus a jolt of his own medicine. Wait. Dark, moody, powerful? Yes, he is perfect. This is it. How sad is this? Huh? Mm, pains me to see it. All that power going to waste. Who are you? Name is Hades, Lord of the Dead, God of the Underworld, yada yada, how you doing? Hey, let me guess. You're trying to put the kibosh on the darkness inside. Am I right? Of course I'm right. Well, anyway, bad idea. Wait, what? Okay, stay with me. Darkness is inside everybody. Nothing to be ashamed of. You play nice with it, and darkness will be your best friend. But if you go and get all self-conscious and refuse to face it, the darkness will run over you like a debutante at a toga sale. And then where are you? Nowhere! Now me, I look at you, and I see potential. That's right, kid. You got the potential to conquer the darkness inside you. And I'll even give you some pointers. I mean, believe me, if anybody knows conquering, I know conquering. Well, let's hear it then. How do I conquer the darkness? Easy. You sign up for the games. I know, I know. Please, Lord Hades, the games. But hey, you would be surprised what you can learn in the heat of battle. And don't worry, I'll be right there to guide you every step of the way. I'm kind of what you'd call an expert in the art of darkness. Oh, decide fast. This is a limited time offer. I do not trust him. I do not trust him one little, little, little bit. Well, that's probably because I've already beaten Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, and Kingdom Hearts 2. So I know how much of a git you can be. Gather! Why the hell did I do that? left in the vestibule. In other words, the lobby. <laughs> Which is the map? Okay, let's have a look. See if I've got everything. Oh. 
I didn't leave you have a Cinderella one. Okay. Coliseum. Hmm. Coliseum gates. Okay, let's go find it. That looks like it over there. Got it. Your fight's coming up! And they can be rather difficult. Especially seeing as I'm playing on critical mode. So I'm going to leave it for the next episode. Albeit this is a kind of short one. But I will see you next time. Goodbye!